5,000 confirmed cases across the U.S. We've reached that number in just 10 weeks. Now here at home, the CDC is confirming 248 cases in D.C. There are 149 in Maryland and in Virginia. The Department of Health is reporting 116 cases. Now we learned today that getting tested for monkeypox is relatively easy, but getting vaccinated, a different story. Here's Scott Broom. Maryland's Governor Larry Hogan announced this week there is enough monkeypox vaccine in Maryland to treat just 3,202 people. He characterized supplies which come from the federal government as severely limited. And he said more vaccine may not be in the pipeline until fall. Dr. Peter DiMartino, chief of the Maryland Department of Health Center for HIV Prevention and Health Services, told us today there are 129 lab confirmed cases of monkeypox in Maryland, and the vaccine is being used only when a case has been identified. Getting those folks who may have been exposed that's where Maryland is using our vaccine because we know if we vaccinate people soon enough after potential exposure, we can interrupt that transmission or we could make the course of their disease less severe. And for that use, DiMartino said he is optimistic the virus can be stopped before much more vaccine would be needed. Meanwhile, Virginia authorities reported to WUSA 9 they have much more vaccine on hand, about 22,000 doses. Here's Virginia Secretary of Health John Little. Our first priority is to make sure that people who were who had contact with someone who has monkeypox get vaccinated first. The second thing is looking at higher risk groups, making sure that they have access. According to the U.S. Centers for Disease Control, one way monkeypox is spread is through prolonged skin-to-skin -skin contact consistent with sexual activity. In Maryland, 98% of the 129 cases so far have been among gay men. They're encouraging anyone with symptoms or suspected close contacts to get tested. Scott Broom, WUSA 9.